Hello everybody, it's me Keys, and welcome back to Let's Play Edna and Harvey, Harvey's New Eyes. I swear that title is slightly difficult to pronounce just because Harvey is said twice. In the last one, we had the recipe for Mother Superior stolen by three ass well, two assholes and one actually like kind of reasonable person. I mean, yeah. And we also have to get a bomb for Suka? I mean, like, she was annoying because she spoke for a long time. Like, a really long time. But, um, at least, at least she wasn't an outright dick to Lily just for being a dick. She was just being a kid who, you know, is really into, well, anime by the looks of things. It's Shawnee. Um, let, let's go find the bomb. Okay. This ball of wool was a symbol of friendship. Lily wanted it to stay in the treasure chest for eternity. Okay. Let, let's just grab the fuse, cause I at least I have I know what that is for. Um. Hello? There you go. Um, okay, this is a bit weird, the ma not being able to click um, to where I want to go. There you go, to the dorm. Hello there, Asuka. Here's your bomb. What have you got now? I hope it's a weapon for the battle against... Wait, what? But that's a real detonator! to Mother Superior. Exactly. This time you really went too far, Lily. What on earth are you thinking? You're even crazier than I thought. Totally un-gumbo. Don't just stand there. Get that bomb away from us. Take it somewhere where it can't do any damage. A bomb-proof place, a fireproof drum, or something like that? You guys wanted the bomb! So I gave you the bomb! I mean, actually, that's understandable, but still! I mean, come on, come on. How how scary is a bomb? Also, hello there, nerd. It was the perfect place to get rid of the detonator. What's that? What, what do you have there? Lily could finally use the hairpin. Nothing. Was it at the blade like that? Lily closed the door again. <laughs> oh Memphis is hiding place safe. Oh, Lily, Lily. Oh. Something seemed to be wrong with Lily's ears today. She kept hearing all these sounds. Oh. <laughs> I. God! I didn't actually think she would bo I w I just did it for a What's this? Where oh had Garrett God. gone? The chapel didn't have a second exit. It's the confession booth, I'm assuming. Lily spent a lot of time in the confession booth. Only she knew what she mumbled during those long hours. At least ever since the father who took her confessions had died of a heart attack. Okay. 
please stay off the slabs, okay? You're interfering with my research. Okay. The cross looked very unstable. Lily thought it would make much more sense to simply place it upside down. Was Frank the nice guy? I think he might have been the nice guy. I don't want to kill him. Oh my god, Lily. Oh my god, Lily. <sighs> Wait. What? Happy mess. Mm. <laughs> Lily wasn't able to loosen the screw with her bare hands. She needed a different tool. <sighs> yeah, I don't want to go in there. Oh, oh lordy, no. Yeah, let's go into this hall, shall we? Hey there, Kapu. What's the collection? Let's go! Let's go into the cafeteria! And oh, I don't. Nope! 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 Let. You know what? You know what? Lily! Lily! Let's talk. Let's talk to Shawnee, um, shall we? Ooh! Look who's coming to get her recipe back! If it isn't our Lily! Goody two shoes, Lily. You better split before I tie your shoelaces together, or worse. You know what I did to your friend, right? Right? Give me back that oh, recipe. Oh, you really want the recipe back, don't yes, you? Yes, I do, or you well, end up like the nerd. I didn't know that. Just give me a sec. So I can wrap it up for you with a bow. Hey! Lily was touched. It was so rare for her to give presents. <laughs> you so don't have a clue, do you? Get lost, Lily, or I'll be forced to call you names. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I'm a real badass. Just face it. You're not tough enough to make any demands around here. I'm <laughs> tough? Well, well, well. What's this? Is this you standing up for yourself? Yes, it is. <laughs> Just look at you, Lily, with your bow and your braids. You don't actually think you could stand up to a bad boy like me, do you? I was playing with matches before you said your first morning prayer. How could I ever take someone like you? You, seriously, do you know how to spit cherry pits or hunt sparrows with a slingshot? Just face it, you'll never be as tough as me. And that means you won't get your recipe either. But you see here, buddy, I have an air hammer. Johnny didn't see. Lily had to find. Oh. Can I, like, take his friend's guts or something? The stove was black and empty, just like the- Okay, we can't do that. What's the- what's the clip for? Let's find out what the clip's for. Let, let's talk- let's talk to this guy. Hello there, um, Kabu. Lily, nice to see you. Kapu. I hope Shawnee didn't upset you too much. He's an idiot. I think you're great, just as you are. Lily's Thank heart you. skipped a beat. You're this actually might nice. have been the nicest thing anyone ever said to her. Thanks, Kapu. You seem so tense. Is something wrong? Lily would have liked to tell him her troubles, but... Uh -oh. Well, if you need anything, I'm always there for you. I worry about you, you know? Thanks, Kapu. You actually seem like, I don't know, a nice guy. Geez, some people can learn some things. Hey, Bridget. Um, don't even bother trying to distract me, Lily. Unlike you, 
I actually have a sense of duty. You don't get to be Mother Superior's favorite by just standing around like a moron all day. Like you. I work hard to get all those honors and rewards. Please. The only thing I'm missing on my path to perfection is the Golden Girl Scouts badge on a ribbon. That's why I'm working overtime to perfect my embroidering skills. Mother Superior loves the embroidery because the pictures of animals convey important values. But you wouldn't know anything about that. You've always been terrible at embroidery Ugh. and everything else for that matter. Bridget, I'm just gonna leave you because I actually don't hate you. You're just, you're just mean like everybody else, but you're not an ass. You guys see what I see? Hey, don't touch it. That's my old Boy Scout equipment. I might be old, but I can... I can tell you stories that'll make your ears ring. Some of them are about my old Boy Scout equipment, but only certified Boy Scouts are allowed to touch it. So get your hands... hands... Oh. Well, he actually seems like a reasonable guy. Like, he's just an old man, you know. I don't think I can, I can do anything here then. It's a shame we can't blast, I don't know, the jerk into oblivion. But that's fine. Let's... Frank? Frank? Oh, I, I stepped in the snap. Wait, wait, wait... No, nothing. I thought I detected a resonance echo in the floor. And where there's a resonance echo in a floor, the hollow space can't be far. A crypt. Or a hidden pool salon. For Templars with outrageously hip hairstyles. What? Your question is completely justified. What would Templars be doing in a pool salon? It's just one of the countless mysteries surrounding the Templars. Where did they come from? Where did they go? Did they get a group discount ticket for their journey? What? And who was their hairstylist? There is just one answer to all these questions. The Great Church Conspiracy. And we can be certain that the evidence is buried beneath these stone slabs. If only I had the right tool to dig it up. Um, find it. Well, well, buddy. I have the tool for you. Ah, It's your lucky good. day. That's exactly what I need. Now, if I only knew where to drill, but such knowledge was probably lost long ago. No one is old enough to still remember the age of the Templars. Otherwise, I'm sure I'd have long since had that church conspiracy by the scruff of its neck. Oh well, I'll just start. <laughs> Damn, how am I supposed to work with all this noise? Frank! Hey, Frank! Frank! Ah, oh, what the hell? Frank! I think you should stop! What? Huh? What? I'm sorry, but I can't understand you. You have to speak a little louder. Speak louder, Lily. Ringing from the drilling. Oh. Shh. You're destroying the holy illuminescence of the stone slabs. And if they lose their illuminescence, they certainly won't be in the mood to reveal their secret anymore. And there's no doubt that they have a secret. I know Templar symbols when I see them. Where there are Templars, a secret crypt with only I knew which slab to look under. But such knowledge was probably lost long ago. No one is old otherwise. If it's one that because there are those with the neck and those without. Lily was impressed. A surveillance room. That was the hard evidence that Garrett was spying for Mother Superior. Well, 
Frank, you're concerning me. Please stop. Let, let's just... Let's just talk to the old man. Because I think that's what we have to do. Hello there. Um. Do you oh, have any stories? A visitor. What a rare... Rare... Rare animal. The hawk. But I don't mean the remake. I what? mean the original with... With extra ketchup, please. Uh, uh, how rude of me. I forgot to tell you, um, to tell you how it used to be. When the pyramids were built, I was the chief flogger on the north side. Yes, yes, in my life I've unified. Unified to bed, I said. Back then, I served as a carpet beater under three different Dalai Lamas. For one of them, I was even there as a rebirth assistant in the maternity ward. It was very different from the year I was an interior decorator for the Mayas. Build a mythical sliding puzzle here, hide a few artifacts in dark alcoves over there. Oh, yes. I was building secret crypts when you were still in, in, in the indie band Inquisition Overload. But it flopped, unfortunately. The time wasn't right for that kind of music. Plus, our drummer had the plague. Uh, I got old. So old that all I'm good for now is as an exhibition piece for history class. Cloud. What? I'll get to that in a moment. First, I wanted to tell you, telling stories takes a lot of skill. That's why I worked for a while as an exhibition piece for history class in a convent school. I just had to tell stories about my adventures once a week. For example, how I used to excavate secret crypts with the Templars yes, tell me below that. the school chapel. Or about my no, time no. as a lighting assistant for the moon landing. Templars. The Knights Templars. Mm. Hmm? W what? Oh, oh, I must have dropped off for a moment. But I was just going to tell you an exciting story from my past. Ooh. Was it the story of how I tried no. to navigate to no, Cape no, 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 Town no, 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 and no. ended up discovering the Eurasian continent? Uh -uh. Oh, I know. I wanted to tell you how I helped the Templar Knights build the convent chapel, right? Uh -huh. yes. I was particularly happy because I had eaten a banana. Or was I sad because all there was to eat was coconuts again? No, the coconuts were when the Trojan mayor gave me the key to the city for my heroic valor. Or was my heroic valor while building dikes in Atlantis? But I think I had an apple that day. Wasn't I a little more sleepy in Atlantis? And angry while building the chapel? Oh, what puppycock. I'm getting everything mixed up. Fortunately, I created a memory aid just for this anecdote, so that I'd remember the location of the secret crypts below the convent chapel. Yes, 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 uh -oh. yes, yes. Oh, someone tidied up the shelf. That's where the objects for my three E's should be. Emotion, engagement, and eating. Now I can't... Um, oh, can't make a fool of myself. Now let's see. Oh boy. We need three E's, and one of them is Eagle. Stop that! I need that! 
Once again, only Mother Superior. Ah. Okay, I am actually confused as to what I should do. Um. There's coconuts, bananas, and apple. Wait a minute. So are you? Okay, I have an idea. Let's just grab all of this. Lily, please be faster. Okay. Okay. Banana, coconut, apple. Okay. Okay. Remember how he, uh, how the old man said there's emotions? With, with the fruits? Well, there's one, two, and three. <sighs> the mask was tough. But did that also mean that one wasn't allowed to take it? No, it only means you have to find the right tools. Something small enough to use the screws. Oh, what luck. Lily was relieved. I'm gonna pretend I didn't hear that. And it was. Okay, be right back. Angry, happy, sad. Okay. Okay. So. It is angry, happy, and sad, right? So he said he was angry when he had the... Uh, oh my god, my memory is starting to become like him. Angry when he had the coconuts. What? No. Place, plate. Okay, fine. Um... I am confused now. Well, he was sad when he got the apples, so I'll place the apple there because all he had to eat was apples. But, um. I'm confused now. Emotion, something, and something else. I'm gonna have to, um. Check that out again like in between episodes but wow wow this was a this was a trip <laughs> if i can if i say so myself um it, this episode is a bit longer than usual but I spent a long time in in dialogue and also just with my mouth hanging open with what just happened here. So yeah. Yeah. That sounds about right. I think I think I'll leave it off here. And that's enough for this recording session as well because what is this game? I entered this game thinking that, oh yeah, it's fine. It's, you know, a colorful game. It's it's all nice and stuff. It looked a bit creepy from the main menu, so I thought I'd make a Halloween Let's Play out of it. You know, played the first three episodes and thought, hey, this game is pretty happy. You know, it's pretty darn good. I just like to swing my arms around, you know. Just being happy, being cheerful, enjoying the calming music, you know, doing all that fun stuff. And before I know it, I have heard demon voices and I have killed a man. So anyway, on that note, 
I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. <laughs> oh. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I hope you guys will leave a like, comment, and, you know, maybe you'll subscribe if you want to see more. And I hope to see you guys in the next time. Bye.